inspires me every day that like, hey, my grandparents built a life out of absolutely nothing. I had one finger on my left hand and I had a lower left leg that was curved in towards my waist. I wasn't able to hold things at all with my left hand. All my toys were held up against my chest and my parents said this was not sustainable. If I wanted to right, go live a life and be running and playing sports like I seemed to love as a kid, then something would have to change. Um, I had a 15-hour toe-to-hand transplant surgery where the doctors removed the curved part of my left leg, so right before the knee, and then they took the big toe that was on my curved foot, that was curved in towards my waist, and put it onto my left hand. So my grandparents took my mom there was a revolution in Iran, and they uh, they immigrated to the U.S. and my entire family, like I have hundreds of family members, they all came to the United States from Iran. So I started a factory in downtown Los Angeles with 10 people working, and then built it up to 500 just to like. And all this credit, they literally had nothing. And so to think about moving to a whole new country, starting a whole new life, a whole new language, like, and just starting out from nothing and, and building a family and providing forever for my mom and my aunt. And then it's just, that's, that's just really crazy to me. So became more apparent that everyone's going on lockdown like yeah uh, we're in quarantine can't leave the house right and I can't see my friends or whatever it's like I was like there's a extremely good chance that this is gonna get postponed I feel a lot better about it now I was obviously extremely sad because like this was like the year that I had looked forward to since I was 10 years old and now I have to wait another year but what is what is waiting one more year when you've waited like so many already